Hi, Steelers. How are you? I have my biggest fan here, Jace. This is my five-year-old. How you doing, Jace? Good. Say hi, Steelers. Hi, Steelers. Real quick, what's your thoughts on this egg? A good little chicken laid it about hatching it with a chick. A big metal chicken laid it? About ha about quacking on it that had it for a chick. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Alright, I think he likes it. I think he likes the egg. That's a really big egg for Easter, right? Uh, Alright, say egg. goodbye. Bye. Say bye, Steelers! Bye. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, there are gentlemen on this page. I know for a fact because I've been following it. There are some diehard men on this page. Um, welcome, welcome to Exclusive Style Thursday. I'm happy to be back. Thank you for coming and checking in and tuning in. Um, real quick, for all of you newbies, every Thursday, we're hoping every Thursday, or at least every week, we're gonna do a live video or we're gonna do a regular video featuring an item from Decor Steels exclusively only for you girls and guys. So for tonight, we're talking about this beautiful egg, okay? Now let's take a look at this egg. Let me show you how I styled it, okay? I am gonna take it off the wall really quick so I can show you. I'm gonna jump right into this because why not? I know there's people jumping on, but you can always go back and watch video the video because it's on a replay for the live as well as I um, post the live videos or I post the video, a copy of the replay video on my page. So you can always go back onto my, on my page. You can also go back on the group page and click on albums and then videos to watch any of the videos, okay? We're also posting them on the YouTube channel. So we're gonna be launching a YouTube channel so anybody that doesn't have Facebook, they can watch the live videos on the YouTube channel. So let me take this off so I can show you how I hung it. Now, this is a big mama, right? Big mama, but she's light. She's really light. I would still put the nail or the screw into a stud just to be safe. But on those nights, yes, I rigged it up because I didn't want to ask my husband to do it. And I really want to keep it in this space, but shh, he doesn't want me to. But I want to keep it there. Anyway, ladies, it's midnight. We don't have a hammer. We don't want to screw. We don't want to make like the drill noises in the middle of the night because that's when I decorate. I don't know about you girls, but I decorate in the middle of the night between the hours of 10 and two in the morning because I'm crazy. And I'm gonna scoot this back a little bit. And I don't wanna wake anybody up. So I totally rigged this up. Now this comes with the two hooks, okay? Comes with two hooks. Whoever gets those two hooks right? Like my picture is always like this. And I can never do it. I don't wanna ask him like always to do it, blah, 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 right? So what I did is I just got some old rope or whatever you have in your stash. And I just tied like this together and so that it only goes in the one. It works, it worked for me. So let's talk about this really close, okay? On the safe side, this looks like real rust, but it's not. This is a beautiful replica of a vintage sign back in the olden days, right? When eggs were 14 cents. But it's super light, it's super thin, it's large. Dimensions are gonna be in the link. Okay, so the link is available in the live video. Also, Decor Steels posted the link earlier around five o'clock so you girls could like get ahead of everybody and, and order it. But we didn't, po we didn't post this on the, um, the regular website. So it's super light, it's super heavy, but it's big and it's large and it's, the colors are beautiful. It legitimately looks like real rust, but it's safe. It's not real rust. It's, it's a print on the tin, um, but it's like on a printed, it's like a print tin. I'm not sure. It, it, anyways, you don't have the, the danger zones of the rust. So I hung it on this wall here above my cabinet with the drawers, which I'm obsessed with because I got this beautiful cabinet on Craigslist, believe it or not. And I thought it was fitting. Now the pictures are gonna show the pictures better and I'm gonna post some of the pictures. I thought it was fitting to use chicken wire. 
So all I did, I mean, I am layering this big time. So this I found, I'm not even sure, girls, and I don't even know where I get my stuff. I'm legitimately a hoarding crazy person where I have like two large shelving units in my garage filled with decor that I interchange between the hours of 10 and one in the morning. And yeah, I don't know where I got half this stuff. It's yard sailing, it's Craigslist, it's side of the road, it's everything you name it. If I got a deal, I'm gonna get it and I love it. And I'm not the only one and I know that. I know I'm not the only one. I know I'm not the only trash picker here. So I thought it was fitting to use a chicken wire basket, right? Cause it's like a chicken, it's a chicken sign. So then I popped the chicken wire basket, popped a regular basket I found at Goodwill. And then my greenery, this didn't really go cause it's not like that farmhouse look. I mean, it could be if you did like the, if you did more of a glam farmhouse, you could do this. But to me, this is more of a rustic farmhouse look tonight. I laid this, this is just a vintage sack. And then I did, I kinda wanna show this up close. Um, I did just a brown, I don't even know what you call this ladies, I'm a hot mess, I don't even know. It's a stand, it's like a little wooden platform stand. You really could got, get them anywhere. These are both vintage, I got them at a mom and pop, one of my favorite mom and pop stores in Elmer, New Jersey um, called vintage farmhouse. And then this little cutie, I got her there too. So these are all like, these are like, you know, mom and pops that are close by, but Decor Steels I know has some white ceramic, has the white posted here and there. And then I know I've shown you girls this before, but I'm gonna show it to you on every video because I feel like if somebody misses the one video, you can always, Catch it again. Again, I buy the long garland. I know I'm gonna keep saying this, I'm gonna sound like a robot and I'm gonna keep saying it over and over, but it's like the best deal. So you buy a long piece of garland and then you chop it up, but you buy like some good greenery, not some fake, some good greenery. Buy some good greenery. And then I literally just wrapped it around, kind of tucked it in there like it's nothing, okay? There's no rhyme or reason for the greenery to look. There's no correct way of doing the greenery. You just throw it in there to make it kind of look like color. I think it like breaks it up. So we have the metal, we have the tin, we have the basket, we have the green, we have the ceramic white and the cutie little bunny I would pair right now for the holiday season. Now, this is the only place that you can order this steel, ladies. It's gorgeous, it's big, it's rustic. It looks rusty, but it's safe. This is the only place that you can order it is tonight on the link. So grab it, grab it as a gift, grab it for the holiday. It's perfect. Took up a lot of my wall. It would look beautiful on shiplap. It would look beautiful on an old door. If you wanted to cut an old piece of wood. Oh, if you wanted to get like um, pallet wood and make like a pallet wood wall, you could pop it on the pallet wood, but it's beautiful. Super thin, super light super large and beautiful. Oh, that was my dirty kitchen you just saw. Ah! Don't look at it, but it's real, ladies. It's real, dirty kitchens do exist. Anyhow, again, I am Joe from JJ Finds and Designs here with Decor Steels doing your Thursday exclusive style Thursday. And hope y'all get it. Take care, enjoy your evening, ladies. Have a good weekend and a happy Easter.